Welcome back to my channel. Hi, hi. Hey. We are getting ready to take Delaney to school and I'm gonna meal prep today. So I thought I would share with y'all what I'm gonna be meal prepping. Um, I'm gonna meal prep breakfast and lunch, which my breakfast is the same thing I meal prepped uh, the, a couple weeks ago, kind of what I've been having over the past couple weeks. I actually found, let's grab these. I found these at Sam's Club last week. And so there were a two pack of them. So I froze the other one and they had a really good date on them. So I thought I bought those so I could eat those over the next couple of weeks for breakfast. I actually, so I'm, I'm going to be meal prepping the same thing that I did a couple weeks ago, but I think next week I'm going to switch it up and do something a little bit different and share that. Um, but for today, I'm just going to do my breakfast sandwich that I've been doing. And then I've got a lunch to meal prep today. So we've got to go grab some groceries. Um, just a very small grocery haul today. We had a big Sam's Club order last week, so we didn't need a ton of stuff. So we're going to go do that. I'm going to grab coffee out today. I'm going to run through the Starbucks drive through Monday morning. I just am feeling some Starbucks this morning. So I'm going to go do that and then I'm going to share kind of what I'm eating today. I think I'm going to do like a what I eat today and meal prepping. I'll probably share like my breakfast, lunch, and dinner and um, share our my weekly meal prep. Hey, good morning. Can I get a venti iced latte made with non-fat milk? And can I add sugar-free vanilla and the vanilla sweet cream cold foam? Anything else? That'd be it. $7.79. Thank you. All right. This is the best coffee. I don't know exactly how many points it is, um, but really you're just counting like the foam on top because that's sugar-free vanilla. Um, but I don't count my coffee. Um, my favorite coffee, even like when, on a day that I'm not really counting and eating what I want, I still love this coffee. It's so good. All right. So breakfast this morning. I know I've shared this, so I'm just going to quickly do my breakfast. Millie's playing in the spice cabinet. So we're going to do bacon, egg, and cheese bagels. Uh, well, what are these called? I can never think of the name of these. Uh, English muffins. Bacon, egg, and cheese English muffins this morning. Um, so I'm going to start. I'm actually getting my pan ready. Should be just about ready to put the eggs in and do those. My easy microwave bacon. Went ahead and done that. Um, then I've got five slices of the Velveeta um, sliced cheese. So very easy. I think next week I'm going to do something a little bit different. So stay tuned for that. I'll share that with y'all if I decide to do that next week. Um, but this week, um, we've had a busy weekend. So I just was like, let's meal prep a couple things that are super easy for this week, breakfast and lunch. So that's what I'm getting started on. Breakfast sandwiches are done. Four point breakfast sandwiches. Two for the bread, one for the cheese, one for the bacon. I put one slice of bacon. And then I've got zero points worth of shredded hash browns and a little bit of ketchup. I don't count the ketchup. Um, so that is my breakfast this morning. And this is what I'll eat throughout the week. All right, it is 1230 and I'm so ready for lunch. I'm going to go ahead and meal prep my lunch and get that ready so I can eat today as well. The kiddos are down for a nap. And so just got my jasmine rice in here. I'm giving that a stir. I just love, I know I keep saying it, I love this rice cooker and I love rice. And so, meal prepping with rice again. I'm gonna let that cook. I'm just using this jasmine rice. I'm gonna use a cup of this with my meal prep. This is the only thing that'll count for points. So, a cup is six points, I believe. Um, I've got two and a half cups of that and I put, instead of water, I did chicken broth um, and that should make five cups worth. So, 
should make it all for the week. So we're gonna do teriyaki chicken and rice bowls. I'm going to cut this chicken up um, small in like small pieces and cook it in the pan. I'm also gonna add some mushrooms with it. I'm gonna throw this broccoli in the microwave and steam it and once it's done, I'll add everything together. I know I've made something like this before, actually probably pretty much the same thing. Um, and I'm gonna use this Jihu sugar-free teriyaki marinade. It's really good. This has a really good taste to it and zero points, at least for the amount I'll use each day. Um, so I'm gonna get started with this, cutting this up, and um, I think I might go ahead and start cooking the mushrooms and then add the chicken to it. So I sprayed my pan. I'm gonna add my mushrooms. I'm gonna give them a good spray as well. And I'm just gonna add some salt and pepper to these. And then I'm gonna cover these and let these um, kinda cook a little bit and then I'll add my chicken and they could continue cooking together is what I think I'll do. And while those are cooking, I'm gonna add my broccoli to the microwave. Let's see for how long. I'm gonna do for like six minutes. I'm gonna get them very soft. My mushrooms are pretty cooked down. I'm going to go ahead and add, this is going to be a very full pan. Uh, I think I'm actually going to cook my chicken first. I'm going to take these out, cook my chicken, and then add everything together. All right, so I seasoned my chicken with salt, pepper, and a little bit of garlic powder. And I'm going to let this cook up. All right, so this shouldn't take too long to cook. I cut them up pretty small. Let this cook and then add everything in here together. So this will be a very easy, it's a pretty easy meal prep. I'm gonna go ahead and get all my, y'all saw this cabinet. I need to show y'all this cabinet. It is awful. This is where all my meal prep containers and stuff are. Um, I'm gonna use these, the, instead of the uh, compartment ones, I'm gonna use just the one. These are just from Walmart. They're super cheap. Um, I've actually looked into getting like glass nice ones, but these work so well, so I just don't see the point. Um, so I'm gonna grab all of these down. All right, chicken is done. I'm gonna add, um, I actually added a little bit of the sauce in there already, but I'm gonna add the mushrooms. I should have drained those first. Um, and then I'm gonna add, I've already drained this. I need to kind of chop some of that up. I'm gonna add the broccoli. I'm gonna chop this broccoli up a little bit. They're pretty big pieces. I don't want big pieces, but they're soft and done, so that's good. Uh, I'm gonna let this kind of cook up. I'm gonna add my teriyaki sauce. My rice should be getting done. Yeah, it looks like it's just about done. I'm gonna add a good bit of this. this cook down together for just a few minutes um, and then plate it all up all this is zero points at least for the amount I'll use each day because once you use a certain amount of this it does add points but I'm not gonna worry about it um, for what I use all right I'm gonna turn that down until the rice is done and then we will plate it all up it smells so good and I'm so hungry my breakfast was delicious this morning, but now I am very hungry. <laughs> looks so good um, I did add a little bit extra of the teriyaki sauce, teriyaki sauce on top um, but it is six points for the rice and then I'm gonna take away a point for the veggies that I have in each one I probably have about a cup in each one so it is a five point lunch I'm getting ready to go eat one oh, it smells so good and it looks so good I ate that so fast it was so good now I need to clean up in here <clears throat> a lot of times I'll do a little bit of the yum yum sauce um, 
I think I should have some of that in the refrigerator, but it's so good on its own too. So I am not going to do that this week. I could have definitely, that rice didn't get quite as done as it normally did. Like it was done, but not as soft and fluffy as it normally is. Um, so I don't know why it didn't because I haven't had that problem with my rice cooker. So I'm not sure, but it was delicious. Um, definitely like worth that five point, those five points. It was so yummy. Um, that's definitely like a favorite meal prep of mine to do. It's just really filling and just something that I love. So if you have a suggestion on what I should meal prep for next week, let me know. I think I have an idea of what I might do, but if y'all have a suggestion, let me know that. But anyways, it was delicious. I think I'm going to maybe have a little cup of coffee for the rest of the day and then um, we'll figure out supper later. So, first of all, ignore my appearance. We have been outside. This It feels so good. I thought it was going to be chillier than it actually is. It's really good. Oh, I need to get your snack. What do I do? Where'd it go? I have a bag of snacks, Lynn. What about a cookie? You know, one of these cookies? We've got one left. So, Callan and I came in to um, Ethan's outside with the girls, and I came in to start preparing dinner. What I originally planned to do for dinner was um, burgers. I was going to do regular burgers for everybody else, like on a bun. I was going to do like a lettuce, wrapped in lettuce, um, like a mushroom burger, and like roasted potatoes or something like that. But my hamburger meat, my ground beef is not thawed out, and so change of plans. We're going to do that another night. I'm going to do that tomorrow Wednesday maybe and then we're gonna do breakfast for dinner so I'm gonna start getting that stuff ready I'm gonna do um well I hope so yes we've got I always just do box pancake mix maybe one day I'll step it up and make homemade pancakes for my family but um I'm gonna do a Kodiak cakes for myself this is what I always do whenever we do breakfast for dinner um we always do pancakes eggs bacon um I might throw some hash browns in there. I'm not sure yet. So we're going to do pancakes and we'll start preparing that. And then, um, by the way, my refrigerator is a mess right now. Um, I kind of skipped my whole uh, restocking. It's pretty stocked. It's just kind of a mess. Um, I'm going to skip that this week. We're going to do center cut bacon. You need to real quick refill your water. Center cut bacon. We're going to do all that. We're going to do all this on the Blackstone, actually. And then I'm going to go ahead and grab my eggs. We're going to do scrambled eggs. And so I think I'm going to, I'm going to do, do you, Lainey, do you want regular pancakes or chocolate chip? Chocolate chip. So I think I'm going to do chocolate chip pancakes for myself as well. That's what I usually do. I don't love the Kodiak, regular Kodiak cakes plain like a like adding chocolate chips to them just makes it so much better in my opinion so we're gonna do that throw them on the black stone while the kids are playing outside i was actually gonna go out and grab dinner once i realized my ground beef wasn't gonna be thawed out in time because i had to head out anyways but i decided to not head out and then i was like oh, i already got breakfast stuff so let's just cook that so that's what we're gonna do we're gonna throw it on the black stone and start getting that ready so we've got our bacon the oscar meyer center cut Got to scramble these up and um, put salt and pepper and all that in those. I've got regular pancakes and I've got my Kodiak cakes and there is chocolate chips in there. You just can't see them. I think they've all went to the bottom. So I think we'll also do maybe some hash browns. I think we might go ahead and do some of those as well. All right, the kids are on the trampoline. We've got hash browns. Ethan's taking some of the bacon off that's done. And I'm gonna grab the pancakes and eggs. Those are pancakes. Do you have chocolate chip, Millie? Do you have chocolate chip pancakes? Yeah. All right, so here is my dinner tonight. I've got the pancakes. I've got three teaspoons of chocolate chips. for So that's a total of nine points for the pancakes. And then I've got three slices of center cut bacon for three points. And then eggs and hash browns for zero. And then I will top my pancakes with this sugar-free syrup for zero as well for the amount I use. Um, so that is dinner tonight. It looks so good. So that is our dinner.